But yeah. So far I'm really liking the uh the lack of bombardment. <laughs> you know, there's no bombardment going on. You're not like overwhelmed by a bunch of shit that like ruins your run. Wait, oh, wait until you uh, wait until you play the higher difficulty. I hate to break it to you, Amy, but the game does get bad. <laughs> yeah, I'll, yeah, a lot of people describe uh, Air Fire as a fucking gymnastic gymnastic, and I kind of like it for that. Hmm. On the highest difficulty, uh, the uh, enemies move and shoot faster. You can't spell masochist without several letters from the word massive and kissed. We should kiss massively. Although, hey, at least here they don't uh, respawn like in uh, Classic Doom's Nightmare difficulty. Nightmare difficulty, get unlimited kills. Yes. And blah. Shooting all these people with my evil crossbow, and then I do the silly thing. Okay, for a second, I thought you were humming Block Town from Pac Mania. Hmm. Don't give me ideas. <laughs> Now, now I have it stuck in my head. You know, you know, because I, I think I'm gonna play a bit of Pac Mania while. while walking. That is true. True as gay and hell and gay hell, which is the best hell. Oh, uh, uh, but but what about by hell? It it's all. Uh, it's uh, when I say gay is uh, is a blanket statement. I I need to not say things. The saying things is bad and stupid. <laughs> At times, yeah. At times. <laughs> Funny language. Oh uh, yeah. At Games releases a time machine. It's the At Times. I would definitely go back in time and uh, slap them in the face for making shit products. You go back in time, but like, but like only halfway back in time. So like, so like, so like half of the world is like in the past and half of it is in the present and it's just random. I don't, know, I don't know why, that just sounds like something they'd be in, uh, they'd be in like a future robot, so... I think they're kind of setting up for, like, some kind of time fluctuation problem. Because, like, the calendar, it's not consistent. But it's, like, not consistent on purpose. Like, it tries to be consistent, but then it, like, rolls back. And I think that the conflict is gonna be that the time isn't working. about right. Oh, hey, actually, the new Futurama episodes are probably going to release, like, soon. Like, this month, right? Possibly. Yeah. I, 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 I really gotta catch up on the, uh, on the new season. It was good. Mostly. It, uh, it kind of fumbled, like, sometimes but like some of the episodes were like legitimately as good as you would have expected sounds about right i really i think that um i think that in terms of writing there were some of them where it's like clearly a first draft that sounds about right but there was this one weird episode about like about like toy marketing that was like not relevant at all. It's like why do you still care about this? This didn't happen 
for this didn't happen in a long time. You know? Interesting. Like, are they trying to cover all the topics that they missed? Although, I'm gonna be one of the people that's gonna say it. I think the COVID episode was actually really funny. Not because... Not because of relatability. It was just extremely fucking ridiculous. And that's what I liked about it. Okay, I, I would ask how ridiculous it is, but like... They have a uh, bone hovercraft, and they go to a witch hut, and use magic to do science. Interesting. And then at the end, Hermes says... Any sufficiently in advanced magic is indistinguishable from science. <laughs> like, all reversed and shit. That definitely sounds like what the episode. Yeah. And people hated that one. That's the one that people thought was the worst one. It's like, like, come on. You tell me you didn't laugh at the fucking, at at the fucking giant Q-tip. <laughs> yeah, definitely sound like quite the episode. <laughs> and let's not forget the, the the skeleton guy made of other skeletons. Yeah, that definitely sounds like quite the episode. How do I get in there? Oh, I just jump. Not, not if, uh, not if you're playing it the old-fashioned way. Eh, it was still a difficult jump. I'd say it's still fair. Actually, actually, that, actually, that, that reminds me in, uh... In Heretic sequel, Hexen, you can actually, uh, you can actually jump in it. Hexen? Where have I heard that before? Sounds like... Hexen hey, sounds like a very it. old Minecraft mod pack. I don't know what it kind of does. Or am I thinking of? Yeah, that, or am I thinking of Tech It? Oh uh, yeah, sounds sounds like it as well. Oh yeah, so like you can walk in, in this like blue like death water, but not the crystal clear springs that were all like gray and shit. It's like. Yeah, gray water does not sound clean to me. <laughs> yeah, but it'd be cleaner than fucking, like. Ass blue water. And it's not. It's not like the sky is blue here. It's like the water is blue. That's not clean. You know. The blue sky was clean. No, the blue sky is clean. But here's the deal. Here's the deal. If the water itself is blue and it's not a reflection. And you can tell the water itself is blue here. It's like a bunch of fucking... It's like... It's like a... It's, it's like if you put Sonic in a blender. Why is my W key not working? What the hell? Why is only strafing working? Oh, uh, weird. Oh, it must be a property of the liquid. Oh, right, yeah. So, yeah, some of them will uh, push you. The game's like, you are now being pushed on the Y-axis. Like, see, that water looked crystal clear. And yet, that's the one that hurts you. It like, kind of looks a bit aesthetic. There's, like, a bit of green to it. Yeah, but, like... Like, comparatively, this looks clearer than... Well, I mean, yeah. Yeah. It's like... It's just weird that that's the one that kills you. It's like, uh... It's like, a hidden acid. You've reached the hidden acid point! Uh. Do you want to lick the funny paper that for some reason is how people do that drug? With, with, with little pieces of paper? Like, that's so fucking lame. That's right. It goes in the square hole. <laughs> I 
I once commented that on my own post of Minecraft Amber. <laughs> I think people got the joke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, so, okay, so yellow was that way, blue is that way, there's green this way, uh, hmm, strange, peculiar, strange, gay, homosexual, gay, yes, so would the green one be, green one, what kind? Schmall. I may or may not be meme brained. Oh, I know the feeling. Brain rot. More like yeah. brain rot. <laughs> oh, right, because the green statues. Me looking at the door. Ah yes, the medieval times! Sliding doors! I could- I could- I could honestly believe that. What- did, what are they powered by? Death? <laughs> Actually, uh, I think the most reasonable explanation would be magic. I like the idea that magic used to exist, and it wasn't just that people believed in it. <laughs> That, that, I think that's a pretty interesting idea to explore. Yeah. The guard tower. Oh, this tower's spooky! Oh, oh look at the golden skeletons! Oh! Joel would fucking lose his mind at this game. Oh, why is that? Because it's like the kind of shit he loves to joke about. Like the ghouls and the goblins. And the. And and the magic little. Oh! You know, you know that like kind of like vibe? Yeah. And, uh, yes, it was, it was, uh, rated for Doom as well. Rated D for Doom. Yes. I don't actually know where I'm going, because this level's fucking huge. <laughs> oh god, is that an arch file? No. It's like one. There, there, there are no arch files in Canonically. But whatever the fuck that is, that's like one. Yeah, it's an undead warrior. Yeah, luckily they don't revive enemies, but, uh, that's when they're actually throw a punch. <laughs> okay, so, uh, how would I get up there? I think there's like a there's like a switch you have to get, but like since you have jump, maybe you might get it. But again, you have to be in and out because uh, when you do grab it, like this feeling just crush you. There we go. That's kind of cool. That's crazy as shit. I'm proud of myself for that one. I would say, yeah, I'd be proud as well. I like how it's like a little weak jump too. It's not like you're cheesing the game. It's like you're it's like you're 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 doing it smartly, you know? Uh. You're not cheesing it. You you're like uh you you just buttering it. Yeah, pretty much. What is that? <laughs> That's like a very interesting sentence, Amy. 
Did you hear that? Did you see that was a very interesting sex? Sentence. Okay, okay. Very interesting sentence. Uh, well, I mean, I mean, to be fair, you could, um, make the sex interesting if you had butter. I don't, I don't know how, but, like, you could. It's just... It's just lubricant. Very salty, irritating lubricant. <laughs> hey, hey, it's a, it may be irritating, but uh, at least it is tasty. <laughs> what the... Okay, what the hell are we going on about, even? Popcornolingus. Yes. <laughs> Popcornolingus. Uh. Where in the fuck do I go? Uh, I'm trying to remember. Uh, the, the, really, this is one of the more amazing levels in the game, but... Show me game. how to die, you're getting grayer all the time, and turn it all against the one. Its design is hard to teach. Very. Another piece of shit plays this game and tries to hit it with some criticism that won't make any sense. Now dance, fucker, dance as you shoot out of your hands and no one even knew something about why this thing is blue. I need to fucking end this video right now. Like instantaneously. Instantaneously. I said instantaneously.